It's another yellow box, so you know what it is. Hey friends, it's our Realme 7 Pro unboxing and camera tour. Good afternoon, you beautiful people. Welcome to Isa Does Tech, where we do tech in your real life in style. 7 Pro. So if it feels like it hasn't been a hot second since the Realme 6, that's because it hasn't been a hot second since the Realme 6. That coupled with the fact that we've been stuck at home for these last few months, it really does feel like it was just yesterday. Except it wasn't. It's been months and we're still here, stuck at home. But we have a white beach. Realme 7 Pro is looking like a champ on paper. Snapdragon 720G, a 65 watt dart charge, an AMOLED display, and 64 megapixels quad cam setup. That sounding like a deal to you? Let's unbox. The Realme 7 Pro. On the side, some Realme 7 Pro branding, and at the back, well, I might unit came with the plastic open so thank you for helping me do my job unboxing this <laughs> so this thing has 65 watt super dart charge 64 megapixel quad cameras the qualcomm snapdragon 720g and a 6.4 inch super amoled yes amoled full screen display i have the mirror silver version with 8 gig 128 gig configuration let's go Welcome to the Realme family. We have here a new journey. <laughs> of course, a jelly case, quick guide, information guide, and the phone. I will set this aside because let's see what else is in the box first. A super dark charger, USB-C cord, yes! and the sim eject tool so first off there is an in-display fingerprint scanner <laughs> we have two sim slots and a spot for a micro sd card look at those cameras hey look at that so that does look like a mirror finish except it is matte people that looks good that detail is really nice it looks so classy and because of that it gives that effect when the light bounces off of it what material is this on the right side we have an unlock button at the bottom, speakers, USB-C, audio port, and to the left, to the left, we have volume rockers, and that SIM tray. Camera bump is there, but it isn't as bad. Right, let us power this up, and then we can do the montage. Here we go folks, the Realme 7 Pro and because that is an AMOLED display and display fingerprint scanner so the screen looks bright and responsive although this is just a 60 hertz panel so it does run on Realme UI on Android 10 and if you've done Realme phones before it will look familiar right so without further ado let's get to the camera tour so this is the main camera that's a 1x there is a wide oh, oof, don't mind my messy room there is a 2x nice 5x that's still very very clear and it zooms up until 10x and wow you can see 64 megapixel ai camera that is the main camera on this phone here we have of course ai beauty mode which you can see the difference right there 
and up top we have auto settings fill light option which is always nice i think fill light is better than an actual flash because it doesn't give you that harsh lighting you have hdr settings i'm gonna put that on auto you have ai ai color dazzle and automatically it says portrait and you can just tap to remove the effect here we have even more filters yes Ooh, i think these are the new filters there is this modern gold filter baka matawag tayong dilawan so let's move on there is the cyberpunk filter i like this this looks cute and there's a flamingo filter right and under settings we have of course framing the timer so that's a three second timer 10 second timer or timer off and then settings to the right we have the portrait mode and as you can see the background is automatically blurred you can adjust it here it's automatically set at 60 percent more more blur right now it focuses on the phone so that means this bokeh mode or this portrait mode works on objects too we have filters here and up here timer and settings and then there's a 64 megapixel mode like i mentioned earlier the main shooter of this phone is a 64 megapixel camera but it uses pixel binning to create better but tinier photos if you want to shoot 64 megapixels though you can do it via this mode there is also ooh, a pro mode on 64 megapixel mode that is pretty cool and ai dazzle color on under more we have a movie mode Ooh. okay so this is honestly actually very very cool so i am assuming this is a mode that they create i interrupt this video to tell you that it's been exactly seven minutes since you clicked this video to watch it and so realme has challenged us creators to see what we can do in seven minutes because the realme 7 pro certainly does a lot in seven minutes <laughs> Pretty cool that from the time you clicked on this video to the time I interrupted you watching this video, it charged that much. Back to the video. So I am assuming this is a mode that they created for people who'd want to shoot video with these devices and would want a host of different settings. So here you have a wide and then a normal version. And then what is this? Ooh, removing all those settings on the sides, grids. What is this? Steady mode. Okay flash fill light and then here you have different settings from iso of 100 to 6400 you have shutter settings one over a thousandth of a second and one over eight seconds and then you have google lens time lapse and you can also do 1x 2x 5x and up until 10x on time lapse you have a text scanner an ultra macro mode best quality at four centimeters so these are for like teeny 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 things you want to take photos of there is a slow mo mode hello 240 fps you can do 120 fps expert mode on photo you have wide and normal shooting in raw you have all the different settings and you have 1x to 5x on this mode well you can always toggle to wide here and then you also have pano mode now let's move on to the other side Hello. <laughs> we already saw the pro video mode, but you have the normal video mode. You have a wide 1x, 2x, up until 10x. Ooh, that is, that looks good. And then you also have AI beauty mode. Ooh, on video, nice. You have 
flash settings up here you have an ultra steady mode but as you can see that did crop in that is ultra steady mode max and then you have wait no that was the ultra steady mode and then you have ultra steady mode max which is wider so maybe we'll check that out when we do a camera vlog test also there is a live video bokeh mode something i really like makes sure that you're the focus of your videos you have different filters who did you see that so ai color portrait or if you just want blue or green which obviously i do not have in my frame except for you know plants and of course red which i of course have a lot of and then under here ooh, there is an ultra night mode for video that is pretty cool and i'm very curious to try that out under settings this shows us that you can shoot up until 4k but the wide lens isn't supported right Oh, also 60 FPS on 1080p. Under night mode, you have a wide 1x, 2x, 5x, 10x. You also have a promo that allows you to switch all those settings. You have a tripod mode. What's this? Oh, starry mode on. So we've seen this on other Realme devices. I'll link the video up here so you get to see that. It's pretty cool, you guys. And then up here, you have all your filters. And now it's time for the selfie mode. So there is a night mode selfie. And this is an automatic flash. If I turn it off, the screen gets dimmer. So the screen is being illuminated so that i get a better selfie then on video mode hey <laughs> please do not mind my messy hair it's been a long day so on video mode yes there is a beauty mode you can see the difference right there not 100 percent. we don't like 100 percent beauty mode i think that's a little much although like i always say enjoy the beauty mode because just like makeup i use it to enhance my real face me also just a note to always remember that no one's perfect and love the real you right there is also bokeh on this mode so you saw that my background is getting blurrier and then we also have different filters <laughs> and the ai color mode is on here too under settings we can shoot up until 1080p so on photo mode hello we have a very 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 specific beauty mode on only the front facing cameras when you do photos so you have smooth and skin thinner face all that other good beauty mode stuff although personally i like to put it like on really low settings just so you look a little fresh but not like your voldemort <laughs> up here you have the flash settings hdr you also have filters and you also have the timer frame yeah i know we have just your selfie on here here we go so always my favorite and then portrait selfies again you can adjust the bokeh there are different filters and we're back at more and that was it for our quick camera tour that was the realme 7 pro let's take a few sample shots to tease the camera vlog test i'm obviously going to be shooting with this phone let's go Realme 7 Pro first look, unboxing, and camera tour. As of posting this video, we have no official price. They will be announcing all those details on September 30 at an event on their Facebook page. So let's all tune in. Right, let me know what you think about this phone. Let me know what you'd want me to try out with this device. Of course, I'm gonna do a camera vlog test because I know you guys enjoy that. I enjoy making those too. If you wanna see how I use my tech on a daily basis, you can find me online. That's at 
Isa does underscore. Until next time.